For the moment, let's say hello to the audience, shall we? My name is Justin. And my name is... I thought I was going to say Oh, I'm, I'm so not excited. Do it. I thought it was going to happen. Mm -hmm. And this is Vash. Today's movie is Prisoners. The problem with this movie is... It's everything. No, the problem with us talking about is this movie... That we movie, had to watch it. No, is that everything we'd want to talk about, or probably every complaint you'd have, is a plot point that will disclose some of the movie, and I don't want to talk about that kind of stuff because I actually want to see it. Also boring. I remember at one point there was a tree on the screen for about seven minutes. You know, sometimes I know that like the directors put in like hidden meanings, like in Brokeback Mountain, this guy was always on the left because he was thinking with his right side of his mind or blah blah blah, some bullshit like that. So I'm like, okay, they're showing me a tree, and I'm like staring at this screen, like, okay, I there's something on this tree I need to find, and I'm looking like, what does this tree mean? This movie could have been about 13 minutes long. I'm not gonna complain I about it. Don't. But think this was this movie way could have way too long. It was nothing but the story of Freddy Krueger. That's all it was. What? This was a story about people who kidnapped kids and did what they wanted to do with kids, and the townspeople were like, those are our kids, and then blah, blah, blah. Watch part two, it's going to happen in dreams. This to me is very much that, like, really great acting, great directing, the editing was good, it was a very intense story, it was kind of a thriller, there was a lot of, like, very tense moments throughout the whole piece. No, there weren't. Okay, for me there were, and I never want to see this movie again for the rest of my life. Neil Jackman is like, Find my kids! Find my kids! Like, I'm surprised Claws didn't come out. Like, <laughs> he, don't get me wrong, Hugh Jackman's a great, 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 great. No, go ahead. So I was trying to agree he's a great actor and he did a great job in this movie. That's what I was going to say. Yes, I was agreeing with you. The acting was phenomenal by Jake everybody. Jake Gyllenhaal. Jake Gyllenhaal was... I love Jake Gyllenhaal. Oh, love, love, love Jake Gyllenhaal. The wife was annoying. Let me tell you something. Okay, I'm not gonna tell you what happened, but there was a point where, like, you know, this lady is missing her kids, and uh -huh. I, or kid, or whatever. How many? Uh -huh. I don't even know how many kids it was. They tried to sedate her with pills, and she said no. That's when I was ready to walk out. I was like, who says no to pills? You would take drugs. I'm on drugs now. You know, speaking of drugs, kids don't do drugs. No, don't do drugs. PSA. Send them like parents <laughs> confiscate the drugs. Send them to me, and I will, I will <laughs> responsibly dis. Disregard? Dispose. Dispose. That's the word you're looking for. Of uh, said drugs. I'm so bored I can't even turn the channel. You ever been so bored that you like can't even reach for the remote? And God no. forbid the remote's broken like ours is. Like, whenever we want to change the channel, we have to actually get up and go to the cable box and change it. Why haven't I just got a new remote yet? I don't know. You it's can... been broke for like six months. You're kidding me. You know how far away the cable place is? It's like yeah, on, it's on 23rd. 23rd. Yeah, I, I never go over there. I you go to 14th Street almost five times a week. Yes. You won't walk nine blocks. Nine blocks? What am I, an Eskimo? I'm not walking that far. That's crazy. Eskimos walk a lot? Don't they do more like dog sleds? I guess if they could afford it. I guess a dog sled would like a car. Like They'd be like their car. Like do you have to be ride. 16 to get a dog sled? I don't think there's an age. <laughs> dog like, sled. oh, you got your dog sled license? Well, tell you, you're home from school today. We'll get you a dog sled. Do, do they come with the dogs, or are the dogs separate from the sled? I, I think you have to... Can you, like, trade dogs on a dog sled? Could you be like, I'll take that, or this dog is, like, broken, I, I want to trade him out, or is it kind of like you got to trade all eight dogs? How many dogs on a dog sled? Six, eight, four, I, I, two? I think it depends on how far you're going and how much you're pulling. Theoretically, you probably could just have one dog pulling Do you think something. you would pull up to a stoplight, and, like, you'd have, like, four dogs, I, and then the other guy would pull up with, like, six dogs, and you're like, rum, rum. Wait, I don't think there room. are probably a lot like, of stoplights. What? I don't think there are a lot of roof, stuff. Roof. <laughs> what are we even talking let's, about? Let's review the movie real quick. I thought we already did that. No, no, of course not. I'm going to give this a three. The acting is fantastic. The story is intense, but like I said, I never want to see it again. So I can't so tell you go to the theaters to watch it. Does it matter if the acting is good if you never want to see it? Like, like, I mean, that's like saying the steak was cooked great at the bottom of this garbage well, can. Like, okay, I'm still not going to eat it. I'll give this movie a... What's, what's one? Never should have been made? Yeah. Uh, See, yeah. the thing is, this movie did have good acting. Mm -hmm. Oh, You know what it reminded me of? That movie where Robin Williams was the killer up in Alaska. Uh, Insomnia. Daylight. Insomnia. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. It just wouldn't go off. That's actually a good comparison. Uh, I... Nicely Don't try done. to make sense of my world. I hate when you do that. I was agreeing Let me with you. me. Fanfare. I'm... Please do subscribe to the page. Uh, Wait, what's it like, like this on, time? I don't know. Like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. 
Uh, we are going to from now this on. This movie was horrible. I can't even think of anything for the subscribe button to look like. Wow, that, that's there you go. We will not be talking about what next week's movie is anymore. We're actually going to put that on Twitter. So if you want to know what we're going to go see next week, follow us here at Vash and Justin. Video suggestions. Oh yeah, what's oh what's right, right, right. Good job, intern. There you go. It's nicely done, intern. If um, you are about to get fired, I would be so glad you work for us. Uh, videos for last week as well as um, Tuesday. And then what's on DVD this week? World War Z comes out on DVD. We'll not a bad movie. Up. Not a great movie, but not a bad movie. There you go. The one thing I'm not going to do today is complain. I'm not going to complain about a single thing. You're not going to complain about anything here today? Nothing. All right. Uh, I'd like to point out the time and date. It is currently uh, 2.30 in the afternoon. Is it 2.30 already? That mm -hmm. was like 12.10. No, it's a long movie we had. It was really... It was... <laughs> It was a... And that happened at <laughs> 2.30. Not even one minute had passed by.